me introduce myself real quick. So my name is Nirut, or you can call me Root in short. I'm 22 years old. My favorite hobby is watching movies. I live in Batum Thani, and I'm going to teach you for this class today. Now you knew a little bit about me, and this time I just want to know a little bit about you. So please introduce yourself, and you may use the following instruction below. So let's begin with Pichai Park. Hello. Hello. Good evening, uh, teacher and everyone. My nickname is Pat. Yeah, I'm 41 years old, and my job is I'm a manager in an organic food company. I live in Chana Songkla, and my hobbies are I love traveling, swimming, and gardening. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, next, PTJ Kapalo. Good evening, teacher and everyone. I'm TJ. I'm 35 years old. I have my own business in Bangkok. In my free time, I love watching really nice to meet you all. Yep, nice to meet you. And um, next, P. Yut Kapalo. Good evening. Uh, I am Yut. Call me Yut Phun Nam Wong in full name. I live. Uh, I live in Payao. Uh, I am uh, 58 years old. I am now retired and my hobby uh taking photo and videos. Nice to meet you. Okay, so nice to meet you too. Um, now we have Piyam Sakun Kapalo. Hello, good evening, teacher and everyone. My name is Panuwa Yam Sakun. Uh, my nickname is Nu. I am 39 years old. Um, I live in Lampun province, and my hobby are my hobbies are reading books and exercising. Nice to meet you, everyone. Nice, nice to meet you too. And now we have Pierre Kapalo. Good evening, Tisha and everyone. My name is Pirawan Panya Kao. Uh, my nickname is Oe. I'm 32 years old. My job is Museum of Fish, sir. Uh, I live in Chiang Mai. And my hobby are reading books and travel. Okay, nice to meet you too. And by the way, nice to meet everyone in the class. And I'm so glad to have you all together in the lesson with me today. Now let's focus on our topic for today's lesson. In today's topic, we're going to talk about the first day at college. And there are three rules that I would like you to follow. First, use English only. Second, practice speaking on a topic under the guidance of a teacher. And the last one, don't do personal things in the class. During the lesson, if you have any questions, you can ask me by raising your hand or typing in the chat box anytime. So now let's begin with the first question, everybody. In this question, you are going to pronounce all the words below. Okay, so we have s and z sounds. Um, seems like easy, but it's not easy. Okay, so you have to observe all the words, okay, uh, before you pronounce. Okay, whether it's uh, pronounced or z. Right? Let's begin with Pika. Can you please read all the words below? Read. Read. Speak. Listen. Speak. Pause. Look. Build. Want. Okay, so can you read all highlighted words again? By this time, please pronounce ending sounds as well. You see, there is S at the end. Please. Eat. 
nukes. Okay, that's excellent. Uh, thank you very, very much. Good job. Now we have Pretty Jacob. Can you please read all the words below? Read, speak, listen, sing, pose, look, tell, once. Okay, excellent job. Good work. Thank you very much. Now we have the youth cup. Can you please read all the words below? Reads, speaks, listens, thinks, goes, looks, tells, wants. Okay, so can you read all highlighted words again, please? Reads, reads, speaks. Reasons, things. Okay, so good work and thank you very much. Now we have Pino Cup. Can you please read all the words below? Please, speaks, listens, things, goes, looks, tells, wants. Yes, excellent job. Great work. Thank you very much. Next, uh, we have POA. Can you please read all the words below? Reads, speaks, listens, thinks, goes, looks, tells, wants. Okay, fantastic, everybody, and thank you very much for reading. Okay, now let's see all the words once again. So there, um, there is, no, there are is at the end, but it doesn't mean um, that it is pronounced okay? So let's say we have reads, so we have sound, reads, speaks, listens, listens. things. Things goes goes uh, uh, looks looks oh, sorry looks looks tells, tells and once once all right so okay so for the s okay. So uh, you you can observe that it's pronounced s or z z okay let's see if any words ended with um, f k p t and t h then you have to pronounce s okay but if any words ended with b D, uh, G, M, N, Z, L, R, U, Y, and V, then you have to pronounce Z. Okay, so those are some tips to pronounce z or s. In so as I told you, it seems like easy, but it's not easy. Right. So now time to move on to the next slide, and there is question two. So how was your first day as college? Okay. Um, now let's begin with PR cup. Do you remember your first day at college? So, sorry, your first I'm day at college. Sure. <laughs> Long time ago. Uh, uh, first, first day at my college. I feel, I feel terrible and uh, afraid. Everything because new, new environment, new area, and new my life. Oh really? Um, where's your hometown? Uh, Chiang Mai. 
But my and my my college Chiang Mai too, but uh, I live far away from city, about one hundred and fifty kilometer, three hour from uh, my uh, my college to my home. Oh, okay. So you're saying that um, your college is located in Chiang Mai as well, but it's quite far away from your house. Yes. Right. And how did you go to your college each day or every day? Uh, by bus. By so, bus. so even it took three hours, you still, um, uh, you know, went to your college and then back, went back to home, right? Every one day? Time per, no, not every day. One time per week. Uh, one time per week, maybe on weekends, eh? Yes. Okay, so um, you said it was new environment. Yes. So, how new? Because I, I think it's the same province. Uh, I think um, Bishan different uh, uh, Explain, uh, yes, different uh, between local student and student live grow, grow in the city. Oh, okay, I see. So it's it's totally different, right? So children living in maybe countryside and and children living in the city. Yes. Okay, so by the way, thank you for sharing and well done. Now we have a new camera, so hello, Pisawan Chakun Kap. Hello. Hello, so can you please introduce yourself? Yeah, yeah. My name is Pan Pen. My nickname is O. Oh. I live in Bangkok and uh, I, my job is a human resort officer, and my free time, I like listening to music and swimming. Nice to meet you, teacher, and everyone. So nice to meet you too. Um, could you tell me how was your first day at college? Oh. <laughs> uh, my first day at college, mm -hmm. I uh, I so excited. And uh, I think it's a uh, it's a uh, very so nice because I I met a new friend, uh huh, and professor, and I see new uh, area. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. Um uh, was your college far away from your house? Oh, my college. Mm, uh -huh. About, uh, I spend the time about one hour. Mm -hmm. If not traffic jam. Okay, so maybe it's the same province? Uh huh, teacher. Can okay, explain. that's great. Uh huh. Oh, so, um, is is your home and your college located in the same province? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. okay. I I I study uh, my university uh, at in Bangkok at Bangkok. Okay, excellent. Yeah. So thank you for sharing. By the way, good job. Now we have you know. Top how was yes. your first day at college? Yes, <laughs> I am. Um, I'm really excited, teacher, uh, because uh, usually my hometown is Lobuli Province, and uh, my university is Kasesat University. Um, you know that I am a veterinarian, so uh, in uh, in the the first two, three 
years of veterinary. Uh, I learned, I studied in uh, Bangkok, yeah, in Bangkok, and the four to six year of veterinary, I start in the Kampang San campus. So it's like it's really adventure. <laughs> Um, the first day, uh, I mean, I have to uh, adapt or try to uh, develop my habit, my my life. Uh, two time, the first time in Bangkok and the second time in uh, Kampang San, uh, Kampang San district. Yeah, so really. Okay. <laughs> oh, so because you do like animals. Yeah, I think I am an animal lover. <laughs> oh, so that's why you you like uh, being a vet. Huh? Um, I think uh, animal cannot speak uh, people language, right? So um, usually uh, veterinarian um, difficult for uh, diagnosis disease in animal okay. when when you compare with the doctor i think the doctor can can say with you when you have abnormal size right but uh, uh -huh. animal cannot talk <laughs> cannot say uh -huh. right i think it's okay. really yeah i i would like to help them uh uh cover the the over sick yeah or illness yeah Okay, so that's excellent. So, so great. Yeah, perfect. And by the way, thank you for sharing. And now we have Piyutup. So, how was your first day at college? Uh, for me, uh, I never forgotten about my first day at universities. It was a great, great day. And I feel so excited, and sometimes I am very confused. Mm -hmm. uh, I I try to meet uh, some new friend, and I adapt adapted with uh, my new environment. And the last one is I am. I was uh, lonely. Mm -hmm. I f uh, far away from my home. Uh, I was lonely. Okay. So, uh, how far uh, from your your home to your university or your college? Um, my hometown at uh, Chiang Rai province, Chiang Rai. Uh, I found way about 200 from Chiang Rai to Chiang Mai University. Yeah. Oh. I so maybe uh, do you, you have to live in a dorm? I'm living. I live in the dorm. Yeah, with my friends. Okay. So by the way, um, thank you so much for sharing. Excellent. Now we have PTJ. So, how was your first day at college? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. At the first day of, of, of going to, to the college, I felt I, I felt excited mm -hmm. because I, I. I was not familiar, familiar there, and everything mm -hmm. is is a new environment. Uh -huh. And I had to get up very early for traveling to for for traveling to the the college. This make me feel sleepy. Okay, so um, is is your how far away from your college? Yes, it 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 is in 
the same province. It's in Bangkok, but it's quite 20 kilometers far from the college. Oh, so that's very far if you're in Bangkok. <laughs> yes. The traffic I is so say, bad. Yeah, I, I say at Ram Kampang, but my college located it's located at Siam. Uh -huh. It's quite far. Oh, so yeah. By the way, we have to. It was terrible. <laughs> yeah. yeah, sure. Even now. <laughs> Yeah. So, um, thank you for sharing, by the way. Good job. Next, we have Pipep. How was your first day at college? Well, I'm so excited about to meet uh, new friends yeah, in the area. Uh, yeah, uh, for my uh, university, uh, is Pin uh, of Songkha University, Patani Campus. Yes, this place, uh, we have a diversity, yeah, people from Chinese, uh, from Muslim, uh, Buddhist, yes, uh, uh, I can, uh, I, I can feel, feel, I think, uh, from their dress, like a uh, hijab, and like a uh, tapio, uh, their dress, uh, so, Excited for me, <laughs> yeah. So maybe you you saw new culture, right? Yep, yeah. New, okay. new culture and traditional culture, I think, because they speak uh, Malayu language. Yes, I learn from their uh, language a lot. Yeah. So, so could you speak Malayu? Uh, a little bit. Uh, when we. Uh, uh, when we, we want someone to eat together, uh, like a makanasi, yeah, like that. Okay, so yeah, by the way, that's great, and it's good for you. So thank you yeah. for sharing, well done. Now uh, let's move on to the next question, everybody. In this question, you will be discussing with your partner about some tips to make the first day at college wonderful. Okay, so I believe that you all have different ideas or opinions, okay? But let's share to each other. Um, the first pair will be... Mm -hmm. Let me check. Hello, Hello, Lu. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine. And you? I'm fine. Thank you. And uh, I want to ask you uh, a question that uh, please give me uh, the trip to make the, f the first day at a college wonderful. What yeah, do you think? Um, yes, uh, I think it don't difficult and mm -hmm. it don't easy <laughs> mm -hmm. um, because uh, for me I think I am a talkative so um, mm -hmm. I try to I try to make a, a friend mm -hmm. everywhere <laughs> uh, usually uh, first I think uh, when when we when we when I when I went to the when I go to the university mm -hmm. at the first time, yeah. uh, I try to fly the to uh, a fly. plane mm -hmm. in my class, and then I think when you talk with him before, mm -hmm. uh, I, I I mean you 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 can introduce yourself for your friend. Uh, that is the important because you 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 try to give information for mm -hmm. for them. And uh, I mean, you you try to give some. Uh, I mean, um, you you have to you have to make a friendly for mm -hmm. for your friend. Mm -hmm. uh, the talk 
is important. You don't shy because uh, if you want to make friends with other people, you mm-hmm. don't shy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> For me, I think about that. <laughs> And what about you? Um, Do you I, have a trip? I agree with you. Uh, no. When we have um, the first day at the college, I think we have. I think we have to meet a new friend. Uh, mm-hmm. It. I think it is the most important uh, when we at the college at the first day. Mm-hmm. Uh, I. I. I think uh, very important about make a new friend and make a uh, get along with them with your friend mm, yeah. with yeah. your yeah. professor yeah and uh, the last one i think uh, to attend the activity or mm-hmm. partic- participate in activities uh, With uh, the fresh uh, freshmen, uh, we have to yeah. to join with them, to join with them, yeah. and yeah. you yeah. have a chance or to introduce yeah. yourself. Uh, yeah. Yeah. To make friends with them and get along with them, I think so. Thank you for yeah, your sharing. So. Okay. All right. So. Daddy. That was a good conversation. Okay. Good talk, and thank you for sharing. Um, the next pair will be P R I C O P O K. So we begin the conversation. Good evening, Kun. Uh, yes, yes. My nickname is O. Oh. What's your nickname? Yeah. Uh huh. Um. You want to share about? Oh, some tip. Some tip. Oh. Made the first day at the college. <laughs> uh, my some tip. Uh, then I, I, I think uh, it's what the uh, my first day at college. Mm, I think we, uh, we make a friendly. Uh, With new friend, mm-hmm. smile, smile, and uh, say hello, and uh, <laughs> talk about with, uh, with, with them. I agree with you. When yeah. we smile, everything mm-hmm. is okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And for me. Uh, when I first day at college, um, so yes, I feel homesick. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and and I try to uh, I try to find new friend and mm-hmm. uh, take them to uh, eating something. Mm. Yeah. I think when we enjoy with eating, everything relax. Oh, yes, it's it's very nice. Mm-hmm. And uh, when when I meet uh, to meet this uh, new friend, mm-hmm. I introduce myself with new friend and uh uh. At at noon, I uh, invite them uh, have run together, mm-hmm. yeah. and and when we uh, and when we want to read the book, mm-hmm, I uh, I invite my new friend go to library together. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So. That was a good talk, and both well are okay. Thank you so much. And the next pair we have P P and P T J. Come to the in the conversation. Yeah. Hello, P T J. Hmm. 
Sorry. Bye. Bye. <laughs> okay. So yeah, you did the conversation. Yeah, I would like you to give give me some tips how to make the first day at college wonderful. Okay. Yeah. Uh, for me, uh, for first day at the college, uh, we need to make a relationship with each other. The first thing for me and smile, <laughs> uh, smile and uh, 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 came to uh, uh, someone we need uh, to ask something in the area. Uh, like like uh, 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 yeah, we we introduce ourselves uh, ourselves first. Like a uh, my nickname is Pat. I'm from uh, Songtha Province. Yeah, uh, what your name? Like this, and then uh, what your subject? Like this, and uh, where is the uh, canteen in the area? Yeah, ask ask them or uh, uh, ask them about uh, what they what what they want to do or what they want to go like that or what activity we have done together like uh, when we uh, live in the dorm yeah where uh, where her dorm like that yeah because uh, for first, first uh, day and at this term we have activity with the a lot maybe we can have activity together for me, first of all, I I will prepare the information about about the college first. Uh -huh. Such as where where is the totally building, where is the library, where is the cafeteria. Uh -huh. And that is the classroom because I think in college um, we we cannot study in the same 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 classroom. I will share to the the another room. Uh -huh. And and then I will try to make new friends. Uh -huh. Yeah. I yeah and and try to do the activity that that the university set. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay. Thank All right. You. So anyway, uh, thank you so much for having the talk. Work on. And now let's move on to the next slide, everybody. So you can see the question four right here. It is role play. You will be given the role and at the top with the partner. Okay. A, you and student B are a college freshman. Today is your first day at college. Talk with student B. Okay. And B, you, know, you have got to talk with A. Um, right. The first pair, let me pair you up, will be and the R cup, so you may begin the conversation. Uh, good evening, good R. Good evening, Ka. Yeah, nice to meet you. Yeah. Uh, uh, let, let me. <laughs> uh, let, let me say it right. Like, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, today is uh, is a uh, uh, rainy. Uh, a proper day in in this college to me. Uh, I don't know uh, where is uh, uh, where is the store to buy to to buy a umbrella. Oh, the umbrella. Uh So I am a, also a newcomer too. Uh -huh. I, I I don't know. I don't know. Uh, the store. Uh, 
เออ and I อ uh, I, I help mm -hmm. I would like to help you I think uh, the store mm -hmm. uh, I, 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 I interview you uh, at the uh, security uh, at the door front of the university right yeah yeah it's a, he, 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 he is he, he know uh -huh. Maybe oh. he know, yeah. Oh, and have you uh, uh ha have you uh, some something for your uh uh, uh, uh say, <laughs> for for your uh course in the university like like a form of university? Did you have it? Uh huh. Like a like like a uh, like a uh. A skirt, t-shirt, oh. some 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 symbol in oh. this university. Yeah, yeah. And and now I have a uh, one uniform. Yes. Uh -huh. And I would like to uh, some five uh, my uniform uh, more. Mm -hmm. oh. We I think we we uh, we go to five the store together. Yeah, maybe I agree. <laughs> you know that. Uh, if I have uh, you to go with, I think you comfortable yeah, yeah. to me. <laughs> no, no, I don't know because uh, I, uh, I I go to uh, college mm -hmm. first day, ah. right? Me too. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Maybe we will find uh, uh, this store. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Have you free time now? Yes, yeah, yes, yeah, I, I, I have free time. Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. Let's go. Let's yeah. go now. Yeah. After we finish, we have dinner together. Yes. Yeah. Okay, okay. That's fair. That's fair. Okay. Bah. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. So, well done. Okay. That was a good talk. Excellent. And the next pair, we have... um. Let me check. P. Nukat and P. T. J. Kap. So you may begin the conversation. Hello, Kap. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Welcome, P. T. Okay. Yes. Okay, now. Uh, yes. <laughs> Hello. What is your name? Uh, I'm P. J. Um, how do you feel about the yeah. first day in my faculty now? <laughs> mm, I'm not familiar with, with, with it and I feel very excited. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I'm looking for the, the room number five to the mm -hmm. first class and oh. and what what is your major um my major is economic and i think do, do you want to find the the room number five right yes and yeah. um, i and my major is economic too. <laughs> uh -huh. okay i think uh, uh is if it isn't difficult for five, number five, loom, number five, number, uh, loom, num number five. So we have a, I have a map in the, I can find it in the internet. So oh. uh, <laughs> it have in the, de uh, the detail of the loom and uh, everything when you want to, to know, but at a cafeteria and Maybe you want to exercise, it have a gym too. I can find on the website of the college, right? Yes, yes. And I think it near, it's near the, the land. So do, do, uh, do you, do you angry now? <laughs> <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think, uh, 
I, I would like to invite you to uh, have a lunch in cafeteria. Yeah. It's done far from here. Mm -hmm. You okay. quite know. Yes, yes. Okay, I, okay. I, I reserve it. Thank you. All right. Okay, you're so that's adorable. And yeah, lovely. Thank you very much. And next time we have P U Cup and P O A Cup. So you may begin the conversation. Hello, Kun Oh Air. My name yeah. is my name is Yutapum Nam Wong. Call me Yut. What about you? What's your name? My name uh Air. You can call me short name Air. Uh. I'm uh I'm tourism major and you? Oh, I am uh I I am major in political science. Wow. Yeah. Uh, uh, it's hard for me. <laughs> yeah. uh, political science. I love. I love uh, this card very much. Mm. And mm -hmm. uh, oh yeah. Uh, what year are you in the university? Are you a freshman? I can't please. What year are are you in university? What year? First year, or oh, second year, or third oh, year? Oh, first year. First year, first year. Uh, yeah. And, and you are freshman too, yes, right? Yes, right? Yeah. Um, um, this first day for today, this <laughs> first day for me in my college, College. Ah, nice. Mm. I I I would like to find mm -hmm. a bookstore. Bookstore can help me. Yes. Yes, bookstore is not not far away from here. Is uh, you have to uh, walk along these trees to uh, mm -hmm. the next the next corner and turn right. You will see the bookstore. Yeah. Along and turn right. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and now, yeah. Uh -huh. and now near, nearly to. Near the uh, library, lunch. the library, opposite uh -huh. uh, the no, library. Oh. Yeah. Okay. If uh, near library too, yeah, I yeah, think yeah. I should like uh. to be. Maybe save my my money. <laughs> yeah, uh, and and uh, may I ask you uh, some question about? Uh, do you know what you are plan to major in? Today. Or do you know what uh, you plan to major in? Oh, uh, my plan. Yeah. Oh, long vision. That's your question. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure. What kind of your major you I like? Want, I want, I want to my own business about mm -hmm. tourist. Tourist, mm -hmm. oh. tourist organize is very interesting for me. Tourism. Many things to learn. Tourism, right? Yes. Oh, really good. And you? I. I I I decided to uh, major in political science. Political uh -huh. science, yeah. Uh, and the last one I ask you, I want to know why did you decide to join this university? Why? I don't understand. Why? Think, why? Why did you decide? Uh, to uh, select this university. Oh, why? Why I select this university? Yeah. Right. Mm, because this uh, university is my dream. Mm. I I like it. Uh, that uh, this you know, this university is very beautiful and very quiet for yeah. me. Oh. Not busy. Yes. Mm. And and I think it's a well known university also, right? Ooh. Okay. Okay. Uh, great right. to talk with you. So, okay, excellent. Come on.
presentation. That was great, and thank you very much, everybody. Now, let's see some assessment real quick. Okay, here we go. Okay, so let's see about grammar. Um, when you said, I'm so excited. Actually, this sentence is not wrong, but the question asked you in the past, so you should answer in the past. Okay, so you can say, I was so excited. And so um, when you say um, people from Chinese, actually, Chinese is language, right? Um, it's not a country. So you can say people from China. Yeah, and the next one, I don't know where is the store. In this case, you can say, I don't know where the store is. Okay. And in this case as well, when you say, I so excited, you can say, I was so excited because it, in the past, and it's very so nice. So you have to choose whether to use very or so. You can say, it was so nice or it, will, um, it was very nice. Next one, when you said, I'm very excited, is in the past as well, you can say, I was very excited. I and the next one, when you said, it don't easy, um, in this case, we say, it's not easy. And the last one, you don't shy, in this case, you can say, um, you don't have to be shy. Oh, okay, there is one more. It have a gym, a gym, right? So you can say, there is a gym. Uh, the next one, do you, do you hungry? In this case, we say, are you hungry? Okay. And next one, at Chiang Rai province. In this case, we say, in Chiang Rai. Because the province is, is big. Right? So, uh, a, any place that uh, bigger than village, we use in. Okay? But if smaller than village, we use at. Okay, as you know this one, I feel terrible. Um, it's not wrong, but answer as you in the past, so you should answer in the past. So I felt terrible. All right, now do you have any questions for me? If you do, you can ask. No questions, thank you. Thank you, Tisha. Thank you, thank you so much. I would like to know uh, different about uh, university and College. So actually, the university is bigger than college. <laughs> yep. Yeah, it's bigger. And any other questions else? Okay. So I guess no questions, right? Uh, by the way, I would like to say thank you so much for your attention for today's lesson. And I hope to see you again next class, everyone. And have a good meal and have a good night. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye -bye. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. See you next time. Room number B1. Hello students, my name is Durian. It's my first day of college. I'm really excited and a little bit nervous. Do you remember your first day of college? In today's lesson, we're going to learn about first days at college. Right, now I better find my room. See you! Oh, oh sorry. It's okay, I'm Claudia. Durian. Nice, nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. So, where are you from? I'm from Texas. Oh, I'm from California. What year are you? I'm a freshman. How about you? So am I. This is my first year too. Ah, I see. So what made you come to California? I think Austin has a good school, right? It's alright, but Berkeley University is better. I see. So is this where you want to come to? Yes, it is. 
Texas is cool, but I want to experience different things. Mm. So what's your major? I was thinking about economics, but now I decided on uh, English literature. Mm. What about you? I major in advertising. Ah, nice. By the way, do you know where building A is? I have to pick up the syllabus for my course. A building. Yes, it's next to the library. Okay, thank you. No problem. It was nice to meet you. You too. I think we should hang out later. Yeah. Can you give me your phone number? Sure, it is... Uh, 013 552 193. Okay, great. I'll call you later. Okay, see you. Okay, bye. Hello students, my name is Durian. It's my first day at college. I'm really excited and a little bit nervous. Do you remember your first day at college? In today's lesson, we're going to learn about first days at college. Right, now I better find my room. See you. Oh, oh. sorry. It's okay, I'm Claudia. Durian. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So, where are you from? I'm from Texas. Oh, I'm from California. What year are you? I'm a freshman. How about you? So am I. This is my first year too. Oh, I see. So what made you come to California? I think Austin has a good school, right? It's alright, but Berkeley University is better. I see. So is this where you want to come to? Yes, it is. Texas is cool, but I want to experience different things. Mm. So what's your major? I was thinking about economics, but now I decided on uh, English literature. Mm. What about you? I major in advertising. Ah, nice. By the way, do you know where building A is? I have to pick up the syllabus for my course. A building. Yes, it's next to the library. Okay, thank you. No problem. It was nice to meet you. You too. I think we should hang out later. Yeah. Can you give me your phone number? Sure, it is... Uh, yeah. 013 552 193 Okay, great. I'll call you later. Okay, see you. Okay, bye. Now, let's keep going. We will learn some common words are often used when we are on the first day at a college. Freshman. Freshman. A first year student at a university or college. For example, he is a freshman. Experience. Experience. To have and be aware of a particular emotion or physical feeling. For example, I experienced a moment of panic as I boarded the plane. Major in something. Major in something. To study something as your main subject at a university or college. For example, she majored in history at Stanford University. Pick up something. 
pick up something, to collect something from a place. For example, I picked up my coat from her house. Syllabus. Syllabus. A list of topics, books, etc., that students should study in a particular subject at school or college. For example, do you have the syllabus? Okay, class, in this part we will learn some common sentences often used when we are on the first day at college. What's your major? What's your major? What made you come to California for school? What made you come to California for school? I'm a freshman. I'm a freshman. I major in advertising. I major in advertising. I was thinking about economics, but now I decided on English literature. I was thinking about economics, but now I decided on English literature. I have to pick up the syllabus for my class. I have to pick up the syllabus for my class. Oh, sorry. It's okay. I'm Claudia. Durian. Nice, nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. So, where are you from? I'm from Texas. Oh, I'm from California. Okay, the first question. Where is the woman from? She is from Texas. Does the man come? From Oklahoma? No, he comes from California. What year are you? I'm a freshman. How about you? So am I. This is my first year too. Uh, so, what year is the man? First year. He is a freshman. And is the woman a freshman too? Yes, she is. I see. So what made you come to California? I think Austin has a good school, right? It's alright, but Berkeley University is better. Okay, the next question. Where are they studying now? They are studying in California. And does the man think Austin is a good college? Yes, he does. And the next question, does the woman think Austin College is better than Berkeley University? No, she doesn't. She thinks Berkeley is better than Austin. I see. So is this where you want to come to? Yes, it is. 
Texas is cool, but I want to experience different things. Mm. So, does the woman want to experience different things? Yes, she does. And what does she say about Texas? She says Texas is cool. So what's your major? I was thinking about economics, but now I decided on uh, English literature. Mm. What about you? I major in advertising. So, was the woman thinking about economics? Yes, she was. And did she decide on English language? No, she didn't. She decided on English literature. And what is the man majoring in? He is majoring in advertising. Ah, nice. By the way, do you know where building A is? I have to pick up the syllabus for my course. A building. Yes, it's next to the library. Okay, thank you. No problem. It was nice to meet you. You too. I think we should hang out later. Yeah. Can you give me your phone number? Sure, it is... Uh, yeah. 013? Five five two one nine three. Okay, great. I'll call you later. Okay, see you. Okay, bye. So, what does the woman have to do? She has to pick up her syllabus for her class. Is a building next to the library? Yes, it is. And the final question, does the man ask for her phone number? Yes, he does. Welcome to ElementalEnglish.com. Today's podcast is on the three sounds of the plural S in English. S, Z, and Is. An English pronunciation lesson. Just like the ED ending, there are three ways of saying the plural S ending in English. S, Z, and Is. For example... When we say the plural S of two basic words in English, cats and dogs, the plural S is said in two different ways. Cats with a S. Cats. Dogs with a Z. Dogs. Why does the sound of the plural S change? The goal for English speakers is to speak efficiently, to say the most they can in the shortest amount of time. When there is a change in sound, the change is often caused by the sound right before it. This allows the vocal cords in particular to be more efficient, to continue what they are doing. Let's practice and understand. Put your hand on the front of your neck and say the sound T. What do you feel? You should feel nothing at all, meaning there is no vibration in the vocal cords when you say T. Now, put your hand on the front of your neck and say the sound D. What do you feel? You should feel a vibration now. That's because the vocal cords vibrate 
when you say the sound d. This vibration or lack of vibration is what causes the plural s to sound like a s or a z. Now put your hand in front of your neck and say the s sound. What do you feel? You should feel no vibration. Put your fingers on the front of your neck and say the z sound. What do you feel? You should feel the vibration of the vocal cords. So the rule is, any time a word has a sound just before the plural s that has no vibration in the vocal cords, the plural s will continue the lack of vibration and sound like a s. Any time you have a sound before the plural s that has the vibration, the vibration will carry forward and transform the letter s into a z sound. There are also some sounds that require an extra syllable to be articulated. For example, I can't even say the plural of bridge without adding an extra i sound before the plural s. So we add the extra syllable to say bridges. Voiceless sounds that cause the plural s to be pronounced as a s include p, t, k, f. For example, weeks, bits, backs, briefs. Voiced sounds that cause the plural s to be pronounced as z include b, d, g, l, r, w, m, n, v, y. For example, webs, beds, backs, briefs. Voiced sounds that cause the plural s to be pronounced as z include b, d, g, l, r, r, w, m, n, v. Y. For example, webs, beds, bags, bells, jars, canoes, straws, limbs, fans. Doves, delays. The sounds that cause the plural s to be pronounced with an additional syllable is include ch, j, s, z. For example, watches, bridges, judges, slices, blazes. Note, the sound of the plural s can be important to pronounce accurately if it affects your being clearly understood. This is especially important when you connect speech linking sounds and words together. Listen and repeat. Notice how I connect the plural s to the word that follows and how I de-stress the function words, such as transforming the of into an a, uh, to create linking and music in my speech. The dogs are eating at 12. 
The dogs are eating at 12. There are bits of cake on the floor. There are bits of cake on the floor. Judges always wear black in court. Judges always wear black in court. The slices of pizza got cold. The slices of pizza got cold. Please put the three bags in the hallway. Please put the three bags in the hallway. The delays at the airport weren't so bad. The delays at the airport weren't so bad. We are big fans of that type of music. We are big fans of that type of music. How many weeks until your trip? How many weeks until your trip? Don't forget to subscribe to the Elemental English podcast on iTunes. And if this lesson was helpful to you, feel free to share it with friends and family on Facebook and Twitter. Teachers. Students. Watches. Subjects. Groups. Judges. Tess. Exercise. Part two, listening. You will hear a conversation between two people. The conversation will be divided into three small parts. You will be asked to answer some questions in each part. Hi, what year are you in? I'm a freshman and today is my first day at this university. Awesome! Do you need any help? Yes. Could you tell me how to get to the dorm? Yes. Go straight ahead and turn right and you'll see the dorm. Thank you so much. What year are you in? I've just graduated and today I come here to visit my friend. I still remember my first day here. Great! How was that? Not bad, but I spent all my first day alone and didn't know where I was supposed to be going. How do you feel in the following days? I felt I was more independent from my parents than I was in high school. Good! After hearing you, I'm more confident now. I think you'll get used to this place soon. <laughs>